New this morning, crops all across the Midwest are behind with their harvest, including here in Northeast Wisconsin. Our Gino Recchia went to Door County to take a look at the status of the cherry trees. Many of you at home are probably getting your buckets ready and looking forward to coming to Door County to do some cherry picking. However, you're still going to have to wait. Cherry farmers have been nervous since January when we had temperatures of 20 below zero, afraid that the cold would damage cherry trees. Some of the sweet cherries did receive some damage, but the tarts came out fine. In the spring and early summer, Mother Nature wasn't too nice either. Consistent two to three day periods of rainfall was promoting disease growth, which required farmers to take action in order to prevent any further damage. A lot of it is keeping the tree in its space, pruning, um, controlling your height. Um, we use preventative measures, um, you know, fungicides and whatnot. Um, some organic compounds as well. To assist farmers with their cherry crop, weather data is put into computer models to project any possible issues. We have a weather station where we, we, we track temperature, um, the amount of rainfall, the duration, so how many hours was it wet, what was our dew point, and we've got a whole complex weather model system to base everything on in terms of disease and even insect pressure. Lately, the weather has been cooperating with farmers. Warmer and dry days is what's needed. The trees bloomed at the end of May, about 10 days later than normal. That's carrying over to the harvest times as well. Right now, it's expected to be around the 26th of July when harvesting will start. It's just a matter of making sure Mother Nature cooperates for at least the next 7 to 10 days. Mid-80s, no humidity, uh, maybe a shot of rain in the morning one or two times, and that would be what we would be looking for. So while you'll have to wait until later this month to do some cherry picking, we're still expecting a good crop yield this year. Reporting in Door County, meteorologist Gina Recchia, NBC 26. All right, thanks, Gina.